Hi, this is Chris Voss here from thechrisvossshow.com, thechrisvossshow.com. Coming to blog post, I want to share with you, of course, we review the latest in social media and technology. This is from one of our favorite companies, Qmatics. We reviewed a lot of their products on thechrisvossshow.com. Be sure to search our website for all the really cool products they've sent us, and also go to their website and check them out. they got tons of Bluetooth devices, earphones, uh, cases for iPad, iPhone, and other mobile devices. Uh, be sure to check them out. This thing's really interesting. This is designed for the iPhone 5. It's called a Tempered Tech Armor, and it's an ultra-thin, shatterproof, scratch-proof, tempered glass screen protector. Now, we've all seen the screen protectors that are those, like, label things, sticker uh, sticker, they almost seem like little scotch tape sort of things you can put onto your screen to protect them. This looks much thicker and different than anything I've ever seen before and probably a lot more likely to uh, prevent scratches and drops and stuff. So we're going to open up and see what it is. This is made for the iPhone 5. Looks like we have a white version here. I would imagine if you have a black phone, there's a black version out there, I, I'm assuming. Um, and uh, basically, let's see here, it's got um, innovative triplex tempered uh, clear glass, nine times stronger than the conventional glass that's out there. Surface cooling pro coating, I'm sorry, surface coating prevents fingerprints and smudges. That's nice. Maintains screen sensitivity and display resolution. And it includes one tempered tech armor front screen protector, one rear film overlay, uh, three. Uh, home button stickers, cleansing kit, cleaning kit, I should say, and user's manual. Uh, so it looks pretty interesting. It looks like there's a front, a back, and a home sticker. So let's go ahead and open it up, see what's inside, shall we? Uh, it's important. So we'll open up the box. There you go. There's what's inside the box. Looks like we got a whole mess of goodies in there. Let's go ahead and open up and see what's inside. Uh, so let's open it up. Uh, there's your instruction manual, how to do that. Of course, we never use the instructions. Uh, it looks like you need to wash it down uh, a little bit. Wash your screen, of course, and then you apply it and all that good stuff. So we'll get back to that in a bit. So uh, it looks like here is the... It's pretty interesting because it's thick. I've never seen this before, but it's a brilliant idea. I think. Um, yeah, look, it's a nice thick cover. This isn't, it's much thicker than those cheap things that you get where they're really thin and stuff, but it looks like it's also kind of designed the same way where it's got a peel off sticker on the back and this overlays. So, in essence, uh, it's almost like having an additional piece of plastic coverage on top of your thing and it overlays in this manner along the front. And then you have your own home button sticker that goes right in here. And it looks like it should, if we apply it, shouldn't make it any thicker than it already is there, from what you can see. So that's pretty interesting. Definitely interesting. You almost wouldn't know that there was one there if you put it on perfectly, right? All right, so let's move on from that. It looks like on the back they have a sticker that you'll stick onto the back and uh, all this sort of good stuff. Uh, it's very, very thin, like you would normally find. Probably won't put the sticker on the back. One of the challenges I've had with the steel back is putting stickers on this does not peel off like it did with the glass. Uh, it's really hard to get off, especially if you leave a sticker on there for a long time off that steel. Let's take a look at what's inside the back here. Uh, we've got a dust remover you can see there looking at us from the back of the package. Um, so, so we've got a dust remover. I suppose you, you probably put this down like tape on a on a uh, tape on a uh, whatchamacallit, there's an assist stick that's here that we can take and use to probably peel out the bubbles and stuff like that, press out the bubbles if you will. Uh, looks like we've got a cleaning cloth from Qmatix and looks like that we've got, oh this is interesting, three different colors of a choice of home button. There's a white, kind of an orange if you will, and a black it might be kind of interesting. Black matches your screen. There's a white one. And that's kind of cool. The orange. Wow. That's a that's your hot Batman button or something like that. Now there is one other thing it comes with. I haven't figured out what it is. It looks like a guitar pick. And we're going to read the instructions and find out what it is. But yeah, 
kind of looks like a big guitar pick, doesn't it? We'll find out what that's about and how to utilize it. So we're going to take some time to read the manual and then we'll try applying it and see what it does. But it's very interesting. Okay, so let's see how the Cubatics works here. Now, I don't stick things to my phone, so we're going to show you by display as how these work. Essentially, you have these where you can take and peel off the plastic and you can apply them directly to your device. Now, you can see this is a really nice thick cover. It's going to protect your screen against drops. It's basically, if you're ever to break it, most likely you would break this first and that would be the thing that would really protect your device. Now, on top of that, it comes with additional home buttons that are really cool. You can, of course, apply these in there, uh, black, white, orange, and you're covered. Same thing with your back. They've got your back covered right here where you can uh, attach the back by sticker and be able to um, protect it from all the different damage that you might take and get. Now, it's nine times stronger than conventional glass. It's got a surface coating that prevents fingerprints and smudges and maintains screen sensitivity and display resolution and it's shatter shatterproof, scratch proof and shock resistant which your iPhone isn't so uh, you definitely want to have this product now they do give you a dust remover which is good you want to pull all the dust off when you clean this thing and what's really nice is the pick that you saw this is used for the removal process if you ever want to remove the uh, stick-ons you can take and insert this and you wedge it under and you pull it off and uh, so it's pretty good for that and of course there's the air bubble stick that can assist you at putting it on and all that good stuff and making sure all the bubbles come out of this back plate because the back plate's a little bit more just just plastic and the the, uh, the laminate cover if you will where the front is a really hard piece of plastic so if I was to bend this it would break so it's pretty cool what they've done, taken and done here I'm really impressed with it. If you're someone who's uh, who wants to put this on the front of your device, protect your screen so that it's going to last longer, I would certainly trust this over some of those cheap plastic fronts because this is going to adhere to drops. It's going to adhere to hear things hitting it and uh, be protective a whole lot longer than this here with just your plain iPhone. Because uh, once you get the right drop on your iPhone, game over. So at least with this, you made a great insurance investment in your product. So be sure to check it out. Go to our friends at QMatics.com. That's QMatics.com. Get the tempered tech armor protection from them for the iPhone 5. I'm sure you can find it for the other phones that are out there. They're probably coming out with all sorts of different products. Anyway, thumbs up. Chris Voss tested. Chris Voss approved. Be sure to check in the ChrisVossShow.com often for all the wonderful and latest, greatest uh, uh, products that are out there. Go to keymatics.com, tell them Chris Fosse, thanks for coming by.